Hello, in this video I'd like to talk about finding the volume and surface area of a trapezoidal prism. The formula for finding volume is equal to one half the height of the trapezoid times the base one plus base two times the height of the actual prism. Okay, so it will be height again. Okay, this height is the trapezoid, this second height is the actual prism. So when we start plugging in numbers, the volume will equal one half the height of the trapezoid, and it is given, it's a line that's perpendicular to the bases, and you can see we got a 90 degree angle there, and that is 3.5 times base one is given here because a trapezoid has two, the length of the bases are two different lengths, so that will be, this 2.5 will be here, 2.5 plus 4.5 okay and then we multiply all that by the height of the actual prism which is the distance between these two bases and that is 4 so now let's complete the, ha the math 1 half times uh, first let's add these up 2.5 plus 4.5 is 7 3.5 times 7 is equal to uh, 24.5 and 24.5 times one half is equal to 2.25. But that is not our volume. We now need to multiply that. That gives us the area of the um, trapezoid base. Now we need to multiply 2.25 times four, and the four represents the height of the prism and that now gives us the volume which is 49 units cubed okay now let's move to surface area and surface area is um, a two-step process you first get the lateral area and then you add that to two base areas okay and for the lateral area you take the height of the prism, so you take the height plus the perimeter, excuse me, times the perimeter, the height times the perimeter will give us the lateral area. And so let's go ahead and do that. Height of the prism is 4, then we multiply that by the perimeter of the trapezoid, and that's 4.5 plus 3 plus 2.5, 2.5, plus 3, okay? And that gives us our perimeter. So when we add this together, 4.5 plus 3 plus 2.5 plus 3 is equal to 13, and 13 times 4 is equal to 52. And that represents our lateral area. Now, that is step one of finding the surface area. We now need to find the area of two bases. And the base area is similar to finding the volume. You will take the base area is equal to one half the height times base one plus base two. And so one half the height of the trapezoid is 3.5 times 2.5, which was from this this length right here, plus 4.5, which is the other length, okay? And when you multiply those two together, this is 3.5 this times 7, which is equal to 24.5, and then 24.5 times 1 half is equal to 12.25, okay? But that is not exactly our base area. Remember, we have to multiply that by 2 and 12.25 times 2 is equal to 24.5. Okay, now that we have the base area, we're going to add that to the lateral area. So the lateral area is 52 base area is 24.5 when we add these together it is a total surface area is equal to 76.5 units squared 
Hope that helps with finding the surface area of a trapezoidal prism. Moomoo Math uploads a new math video every day. Thanks for watching.